Hey guys, and welcome back as we head into March Madness, the most exciting time of year for college basketball fans. If you're interested in getting all of our college basketball picks for today, including our daily free play, you can access all of those over at stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. Heading into this one, I'm going to be talking about this matchup over in the AAC between Wichita State and Central Florida. Give our lean on who we feel has the better edge to cover. The road team today, Wichita State, coming in as about eight to eight and a half point favorites. And on the year, Wichita State, they've generally been living up to their high expectations. They're at 23 and five overall and 13 and three within the American Athletic Conference, their first year within their new league. Some people thought Wichita State could struggle a little bit more this year going into a tougher league with a more difficult overall schedule throughout the course of the regular season. But that really hasn't been the case. Wichita State, they've been a consistent performer and shown that they can get the job done within a league that's a little bit tougher than where they came from out of the Missouri Valley. In their last outing, Wichita State came through on the road against SMU. A nice win for them, picking up that victory by final of 84-78. to 78. They actually lost to SMU at home earlier within league play, so it was nice for Wichita State to get a bit of a revenge win there over the Mustangs. Also earlier within a league play, Wichita State completely dismantled UCF at home beating the Knights by a final of 81 to 62. And on the year, this Shockers team, they've been very balanced on both sides of the ball, but generally they've been an offensive force, 15th in all of the nation in scoring average, third in assists, ninth in rebounding compared to 145th in total team defense, a positive plus minus on the year of over 13 points. We compare them over to the home team here, the UCF Knights, Having a disappointing season, certainly just at 17 and 11 overall and 8 and 8 within a league play. Of course, UCF, not quite the same force without their big man, center Taco Fall. He's going to be out here again today for the Knights in their last outing. UCF did not look very good on the road against Temple. They wanted to lose that one by a final of 56 to 75. And UCF offensive consistency has been an issue for this group, but their defense has been elite. Unfortunately, without Taco Fall out there on the court, their defense isn't quite as dominant, but the Knights on the year right now, they're 344th in the nation in scoring average. They average about 22 points less per game than Wichita State, and they're also third in the nation in total team defense. A very slight positive plus minus on the year of right around a point. They're also 337th in the nation in assists, so also a team that doesn't share the ball all that well. A very disappointing year for the Knights. They might not even make the NIT, which would be just very disappointing for this group overall. But coming into this one, we see Wichita State as being able to get the job done here. They're still playing for their seeding for the NCAA tournament. And also, they already have one convincing win over UCF under their belt this year. And we expect the Shockers to go ahead and pick up another convincing win here today over the Knights as they go on to cover what currently stands as about an eight to eight and a half point spread. If you agree, give the video a thumbs up. If you disagree, give it a thumbs down. Check out all of our college basketball picks for today, including our daily free play over at stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. And be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. Thanks for stopping on in. We hope to see you guys in future videos. Bye.